Sustainable resilient food system is for students who are interested in going out in communities and really working with food in a broader sense. It has to do with really looking at everything that that's involved with food and how we can move forward into the future with really considering sustainability. That is, how would we have food systems that would last into many, many generations into the future? And then how can we be more resilient in those food systems? So all the changes that are happening in the world, so that would include climate changes that we're now experiencing. What do we do with changes in maybe rural and urban? Um, what do we do when food systems might change because of changes in resources? So water quality or quantity might be changing. Soil might be changing. Biodiversity changes. Seeds may change. So we're really looking at what's involved with those changes. Students can pick an emphasis such as business, communications, food, natural resources, and public health. They can work with geography, you know, mapping. GIS mapping is a, is a big tool. The impact of geography on, on, on food and, and the environment is, is big. You can work with business um, because there's this... Uh, um, small business element, economics element, so you can work with that department. So there's many opportunities for students to be on campus and specialize in what part of the food system that you really want to be a little bit more educated and you can get those courses here. This is the first semester of the degree, but more and more students are taking interest in it. I don't really have anyone to look up to and ask questions about like their career. Um, opportunities and stuff like that. So yeah, it's a little scary going to, into something new, but um, I decided to take the chance because it is something that I'm really interested in learning about. For SPTV, I'm Ji Sung Kim.